Okay guys, another real quickie here. I, I'm still bemused, I guess is the word, or befuddled or something about this photo V carve. So I thought, well, I'm going to go back and find their tutorial. I was looking online and I found their tutorial about this baby picture. And I'm going to use that tutorial and go through step by step by step by step setting up that tutorial. Now let me show you what I did. Pull this up here. I think you can see that, but I'll zoom in a little bit. There we go. Alright, get my ugly picture face out of the way. This is the baby face or tutorial that they got. And they have a tutorial here. It's it's covered up. But anyway, I went down. I see if I can uncover it. No, it it's. Yeah. Well, anyway, I went down and used their tutorial. Went step by step by step by step on that tutorial. Tutorial. Excuse me. I can't talk. Then I went into Easel and I imported into Easel. Well, first I saved this out to my uh, desktop. And then I went into Easel and imported from my desktop. I found that file. I saved it as uh, Photo V Car Baby. Went out and found it on my C drive on my desktop and imported it. And this is what it showed here. This is what it was going to carve. Or at least that's that's what it replicates. And, and well, that's what it's carving those lines I guess because that's what I got just a bunch of lines there's the outline of the face the head but there's there's no definition there's no nothing it's just these lines so either easel is not working with photo V card for some reason or there's something else that I'm missing out on because I don't know where to go or what to do. I, I'm just about befuddled with this. Let's see what this. Oh, here it is. Getting started. Here's the here's the instructions on the getting started instructions they have for doing this. And I went through starting up here with uh, loading loading this, and then went on down through these instructions, followed them step by step explicitly, set up everything like they said to set it up. And then I exported it, like it says, save the toolpath and give it a suitable name, which, which I called it the Photo B Carb Baby. Sent it to my desktop. And then I went out here in the easel. And I went into file import G code choose the file and I went to my desktop and it's do, 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 down here somewhere there photo V car baby tap and I I told it to open that file and import it and when it imports it This is what I get out here. Now, I don't know. <laughs> Let's make that bigger so it'll show up on the screen. But what's that showing is just those lines back and forth. And basically, that's what the machine's carving those lines back and forth. It's not giving me this or anything even closely replicates that replicates that so I don't know I guess tomorrow I'll give Inventables a call see what they can tell me in the meantime again I'm that porch or, or post toad I'm out here I can't get there by myself I need help so then you guys see this and you know what I'm not doing correctly or what I should be doing that I'm not doing I fellas I'm open I am open for any suggestions also if uh, it'll help 
I'll if you'll send me an email or notify me here on uh, the forum, uh, I'll send you my phone number and and you can call me or I can call you or whatever if you would be willing to do that with me. Walk me through this thing. Uh, I don't know what else to do. I follow the instructions explicitly. I've done everything the instructions say to do, and I'm still not getting the result I should be getting. So. I'm beginning to think easel won't work with this, but I don't know. I won't know until I call uh, Inventables tomorrow and uh, find out. But anyhow, <clears throat> that's me venting for the night. I'll post this little video on to my other video or after my other video that I posted earlier this evening. And uh, we'll go from there. Again, CNC Woodworker, uh, I'll thank you in advance. I'll. I will thank you in advance for any help that you can give me. Have a good evening.